Hi, Moon will make its move in the sign of Capricorn on 4th of July and from 4th till 6th, Moon will be in Makara Rashi, Capricorn, Moon, Capricorn Zodiac sign. And when Moon will be in Capricorn, it will find the Lord of Capricorn Saturn second from itself, whereas it will be aspected by Venus. Now, we all know that Venus will make its move in the sign of uh, sign of Leo on 7th, that means Venus will be in Gandanta. So, Moon will directly watch a Venus which will already be at 28 degree plus in the Cancer Zodiac sign and uh, Moon will also encounter Sun and Mercury in the 6th. Therefore, this is a time when you will have to be slightly cautious about your relations, you will have to be slightly cautious about your approach towards your spouse and uh, in, in case of business, if you are doing a business deal on these two days, be slightly careful, know the nuances, know the consequences because Mars will be 8th from this moon aspecting your third house, which means it can, uh, it can manipulate your efforts, it can, uh, you, you can take decisions based on fear and uh, competition or ego and which will only result into further more complication and therefore if you are more humble, if you are taking things lightly, uh, it will be really good for you. Uh, the most affected zodiac sign will be Taurus, Cancer, Virgo and Capricorn. Uh, pray to Bhagwan Chandra by chanting Chandra Gayatri Mantra. You can also pray to Bhagwan Krishna, listen to some flute music and because moon is in Capricorn, this is the time to act on your thoughts and emotions. It is a good time to come out of any, class, any, any kind of fear because it will, in, it will make you face your fear and if you work on it, if you chant Hanuman Chalisa seven times for these two days, you will see that uh, it will help you, uh, you know, get close to your fear and then win over it. This is the time when you should win over yourself and focus more on how you can bring dharma and uh, karma coming together basically on the same track. So, but for career, this is a good time. You might experience a, a kind of a wave of emotion where you will be asked to follow your talent, follow your heart. Do that, but don't take any drastic step. Check the feasibility and then act on your emotions. Be careful about the words that you speak because of retrograde Saturn being second from the moon. Focus on your diet and uh, spend less. You were watching. Hi, you are watching Sadgame. This is a channel for short astrology videos for astrology updates on the go. We'll meet you in the next video. This was Moon Transit in Capricorn. Please subscribe to the channel, hit the bell icon and stay connected. This is your host Puneet. Namaste.